What's going on, everybody? Jordan from Miami New Productions here, and welcome to Commentary Tuesday, Numero Dos. I'm here with, and, so, today's topic, uh, games that were hyped for, uh, not necessarily in 2013, because one of mine, one of my hyped games falls out of that category, but just in general, um, so I guess I'll start, um, and I'm, we're each, we're each gonna list the games that we're hyped for and give a reason why we're excited for them. So I'm starting off with Star Citizen. That's number one on my list. And the reason for that is because it's just like... Uh, and guys, feel free to uh, join in when we're talking about this. But it's just like completely revolutionizing the space sim with, what with you know, the graphics and the way the economy works and the physics and just everything about it. It's just like the next-gen title that the PCs needed for a long time and it's finally here. And what are your... What do you got? Well, it, yeah, it'll it'll be here in two years, but they're re they're releasing modules, so um, you may see you'll see tomorrow um, in Indie Game Wednesday. Um, it's not really an indie game, but a lesser known game. You'll see uh, I'm showing off the hangar module. So um, yeah, it's really sexy. Um, so like, what do you guys think about it? About it? Star Citizen? Yeah. Fun. It's revolutionary with the online. And just everything that they do, like, I don't understand how it's running on current gen. Well, if you've ever played Freelancer, you'll know, like, the game is in good hands. Like, the guy who made the game isn't, an, isn't, it's just ridiculous. I don't know how they're managing. He's with a company. No, 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 it's like, it's more like 50 people. It's just gonna be a lot of 50 to 100 people. That, yes it is. They're, Notch made the game, Notch made Minecraft with one person. Switching goodness. And, um... So, yeah. Anyway, okay, uh, okay. So, do you guys want to list number one on each of our lists, or do you want me to just go down my list and then Noah goes down his? All right. So then next is Grand Theft Auto Four, and that and it's obvious. Grand Theft Auto Five. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Grand Theft Auto Five. <laughs> and the re the reason I'm excited for this. <laughs> Shut up. The reason why I'm excited for this is just because it's it's, it's Grand Theft Auto. I, I mean, you can't not be excited for it. Fox. I liked it, but, you know, it was just kind of... For I, you. were not trying to compete with Black. <laughs> All right. Um, I never really that much and just Battlefield 4 kind of just, you know, threw that all away. And it's going to be a Battlefield game. It's going to be a Yeah, Noah's, Noah's buying the $150 edition of the game. Because Noah's retarded. these games on my list are revolutionary. But, um... I don't have enough money for that shit. I'm, probably, I'm about... I'm buying the $80 edition just for the case. Jumping jetpack, running on walls action. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot. All right. Well, then I'm gonna cry in a corner. Goodbye. Yeah. So anyway, <laughs> moving on. Battlefield Four is third on my list, and just, d d just you can't. Oh, they're like, it looks so good. It, it's just the game, the game mechanics, just everything, Levolution, just dynamic. Yeah, that just everything about it. But it's, it's gonna, gonna be amazing. Uh, uh, I just a crap game like Call of Duty normally is. Yeah. So it's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm a huge Battlefield fan. I've owned every one of them except for 2142. Um. Jason, what do you think I'm playing right now? What do you think this commentary is going over? Tell it's a next gen game. Like all the social aspects of it. Um. Next game is Titanfall. Details with the guy, you know, closing the door and. Now. Um. The tablet integration. Okay. This is going to be the Call of Duty killer. This is going to be the Call of Duty killer. No, 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 no. Jason, if you didn't know this, it, it, um, Respawn Entertainment, the company that's making Titanfall, was founded by the two people who quit Infinity Ward back during that whole suing thing back in, what was it, 2010? I don't remember. I don't remember. I really don't. But that also caused a lot of controversy. Anyway, so it's the people who basically... Started up Infinity Ward and cool made the Modern Warfare series. So this game is the well, Call of Duty formula. It's you know, non-stop, fast-paced action, next-gen. It's going to be on PC. I just can't wait. It, it looks... I mean, I'm, I'm like, the the people that have been playing it at, you know, PAX and Gamescom, so they said it's fantastic. So, um, like... Thank you guys for watching commentary Ghosts, yeah, fuck that. And I will see you guys tomorrow in Indie Game Wednesday.